Hey, welcome back. So I'm gonna. F so here's the plan for the day. I'm gonna get the last jiggy. I have one jiggy left to get. If you look at my totals, rusty bucket. I have one left, and the rest should all be ten. So I'm gonna get this last one, and then I know how to get it. But I'll just see if I can do it. But so that'll be today, and then tomorrow I'll finish. Um, I'll fight the final boss or whatever. Okay, that was bad. I don't like that. Let's see if I can do it. Uh, I shouldn't have done it like that. Come on. Oh, ah. all right. So. Let's restart. <laughs> I save right there. Okay, ready? I was gonna talk today. I didn't have that many notes this week. I always say that and I usually end up having enough, but today felt really short um, with notes. Um, so, but I thought it would be good because, oh, no, that didn't work. Um, I won't really talk too much when I fight the final boss, and you can skip that if anybody's even watching anyway, which nobody is. <clears throat> um, I can talk about a note today if I can concentrate while I'm doing this. Uh, oops. <laughs> this is hard. I should have done the other one first. I'm so stupid. No, I don't know what I'm doing. Just go. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to save after this cutscene. Like that. There we go. Okay, no, no, no. <laughs> so then if I just do F7, I'm here. Okay. Okay, this is bad. What? Just go, just go. Ah, okay. <laughs> That's not how you do it, but I'm going to save. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad that worked out. Then go, 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 go. Okay. Eee. Being joke. I'm just going to talk about Anna Corinne in a, a little bit. I finished part two. Well, I'm on the last chapter. I didn't really finish it yet. Um, which is good. Like, I'm moving through it. I thought it would take, like, years to finish it, but... Uh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna save... Cause, uh, I think it's this way. Is it this way? Or is this the wrong way? That seems wrong. Okay, this is the front. I have to go this way. Okay. I can make it, I can make it, I can make it, I can make it. No, what am I doing? Just go down. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Eh. I got it. Oh wait, but uh, what they're gonna give it to me though, right? Did I get it? Ugh, I got a hundred percent. Look at this, hundred percent, hundred percent. Clicky clock, hundred percent, hundred percent. Wow, such a big deal. We did it. So now I want to do one more thing. So I, the other thing I did was I got 
See how I used to have 50 red feathers, but now I can have 100. There's a little cheat code, so that's what I'm gonna do next. Um, Anna Karenina. One of the things I was gonna talk about was the fact that um, I don't, I, I've noticed, I mean, this is, I don't have much feedback from like people watching like, oh, I like when you talk about this and I don't like when you talk about this. So it's just me, like when I talk, what I feel. And I feel like when I talk about TV or movies or books now, like this fiction book, <clears throat> I don't think I really have an interesting perspective or like, um, I don't, I don't, doesn't feel like I'm being very interesting when I talk about it. Like when I talk, I watched this Ted Lasso, like what am I going to say about Ted Lasso that is interesting? Um, I mean, nothing I say is really that interesting, but when I talk about like religion and anxiety and, and stuff, I feel like I bring a little bit more of an interesting perspective, and I think that's why I like talking about those things more. Because I'm reading Anna Karenina, and I have one note about it, but the, the way I feel is just like, oh, I like it. <laughs> and I don't really have too much interesting to say about it. Like, I'm not a literary critic. I don't know what's good about it or what's bad. Um, so, I don't know, it's it's nice that at least I know. I mean, when I talk, sometimes I get a feeling like, okay, this is not interesting, or, oh, this is, I mean, yeah, I mean, nothing I say is super interesting, but there are certain times where I'm like, oh, this is a little bit more interesting, and this is stupid. Why am I talking about... Like, I've been watching the X-Files, and I don't really have anything interesting to say about it. I've been listening to this X-Files podcast, and, and they do a pretty good job. They're okay. Um, but, like, they talk about an episode for an hour and a half, and, and they go, like, in-depth. I'm going to save. Uh, wait, which remember which one is the right one? F5, okay. Um... They talk about it more. Every anything that I say, I don't, wouldn't be able to think of anything original for the X Files or whatever. Ted Lasso. I watched Ted Lasso. I liked it. It's a lot. I, it's a lot harder for me to get into a comedy show than a drama show for some reason. The comedy shows they try so hard. Sometimes you're just like, ugh, stop trying so hard. But Ted Lasso's good. I like it. Uh, there's a secret here. Um, so maybe I'll, I'll try to do my little anacrid in a note for the next three minutes. Oh, last time I tried to think of an example of Tolstoy like explaining interactions well. So the next time I read, I tried to, to write down one. <clears throat> um, the thing is, he, he over explains interactions, but he ex that sounds like a bad thing. Like, oh, he over explains it. But he has to because the way he describes the interaction, like there is a lot going on between this character and this character. Um, so he does have to over explain it. A lot of books <clears throat> or like TV shows with narration, they'll over explain stuff, but it's like stuff you can figure out by just looking at like what's happening. And they'll be like, oh, I, I don't like this person and blah, blah, blah. But it's like stuff, it's boring because you already know what's happening and then they're just over explaining it. Um, but Tolstoy, is over explaining it but like there's a lot going on so it's interesting where's this stupid thing why can't i find it it's uh it's so easy to find where is it i don't know 
So, okay, spoilers for part two. Anna and Vronsky are having an affair, and Anna has a kid, and whenever Vronsky comes over, um, the kid kind of acts weird, and so he over-explains, it's like he spends like a whole chapter explaining how, um, I feel like such an idiot that I can't find this stupid thing. Um, Anna, Anna's awkward, like, Anna and Vronsky, on the surface, they don't act different, but the kid can, can tell that something is weird between the two of them, because when Vronsky and Anna meet around Anna's son, they act, he says, like, they act like acquaintances, but the kid can understand that, like, this person is important to Anna, and so... <clears throat> But the kid is so young that he doesn't really fully understand that feeling, so he kind of, um, in a way he puts it on himself and he's like, oh, maybe I'm doing something wrong, and he explains that feeling, like, and that, so that's really interesting. Finally found a stupid thing. Um, so I, I don't know, I'm just reading the book and trying to figure out why it's the on wikipedia it says it's the best book ever written i'm like oh, that's a good that's probably why because i don't read a lot of books but whenever i do read books like a fiction book um i do get this feeling like oh i don't really like it because it feels like it's over explaining things that are kind of obvious <laughs> even when i read um I tried to read this book from the guy who wrote The Martian. I think it's called Artemis. I tried to read that book and I didn't really like it because I just felt like it was over explaining stuff. And it's just kind of boring. But I didn't get that feeling with Fennecorbinen. I think you have to spell. So I'm going to do this and then this is going to be the end of the day. What's the other note? Good writers explain thing that you wouldn't normally think about. Yeah, whatever. Okay. Uh, so when you go to Cheeto, I already have the code. I think it's Gold Feather. Banjo Kazooie. Santa Corbin and a treasure we grow. Santa Corbin and a sea where it leads. Um, gold feathers. <coughs> I got post nasal drip again. Why does it keep happening to me? G O L. Where's L? I feel like this is a. Oh, there it is. G O L D. L D. F. G. H. E. R. S. <gasps> Whoa! So that's it. 100%ed it. <clears throat> I got all the cheats. I got all the jiggies and all the notes. And I got all the. What's the third thing? That's it, right? Um. And the honeycomb pieces. I got everything. I never beat this game before, and I definitely never got 100%. So, that's cool. And tomorrow I'll fight the boss. And so, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks.